The IEEE standard for floating point arithmetic IEEE is a technical standard for floating point computation established in 1985 by the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers The standard addressed many problems found in the diverse floating point implementations that made them difficult to use reliably and portably. Many hardware floating point units now use the IEEE 754 standard. The standard defines Arithmetic formats, sets of binary and decimal floating point data, which consist of finite numbers including signed zeros and subnormal numbers, infinities, and special not a number values nans. Interchange formats, encodings bit strings that may be used to exchange floating point data in an efficient and compact form Rounding rules, properties to be satisfied when rounding numbers during arithmetic and conversions Operations, arithmetic and other operations such as trigonometric functions on arithmetic formats Exception handling, indications of exceptional conditions such as division by zero, overflow, etc. The current version, IEEE 754-2008 published in August 2008, includes nearly all of the original IEEE 754-1985 standard and the IEEE standard for radix independent floating point arithmetic IEEE 854-1987. Standard development. The current version, IEEE 754-2008 published in August 2008, is derived from and replaces IEEE 754-1985, the previous version, following a seven-year revision process, chaired by Dan Zuras and edited by Mike Kalashaw. The international standard ISO, IEC, IEEE 60559-2011 with content identical to IEEE 754-2008 has been approved for adoption through JTC1, SC25 under the ISO, IEEE PSDO agreement and published. The binary formats in the original standard are included in the new standard along with three new basic formats, one binary and two decimal. To conform to the current standard, an implementation must implement at least one of the basic formats as both an arithmetic format and an interchange format. As of September 2015, the standard is being revised to incorporate clarifications and errata. Formats An IEEE 754 format is a set of representations of numerical values and symbols". A format may also include how the set is encoded, a floating point format is specified by a base also called radix B, which is either 2 binary or 10 decimal in IEEE 754 a precision P an exponent range from Emin to Emacs, with Emin equals 1 minus Emacs for all IEEE 754 formats, a format comprises Finite numbers, which can be described by three integers, s a sign 0 or 1, c a significant or coefficient having no more than p digits when written in base b i.e., an integer in the range through 0 to b p-1, and q equals an exponent such that m and q plus p-1 emacs. The numerical value of such a finite number is minus one s times c times b q. Moreover, there are two zero values called signed zeros. The sign bit specifies whether a zero is plus o positive zero or minus zero negative zero. Two infinities plus infinity and minus infinity. Two kinds of nan, not a number, a quiet nan q n a n, and a signaling nan snan. For example, if b Topic ten P seven and Emacs Topic ninety six, then Emin 
Minus 95, the significant satisfies 0c 9999999, and the exponent satisfies minus 101q90, the smallest non zero positive number that can be represented as 1 times 10 minus 101, and the largest as 9999999 times 1090, and the full range of numbers is minus 9.999. 9999 times 1096 through 9.999999 times 1096 the numbers minus b1 minus emax and b1 minus emax here minus 1 times 10 minus 95 and 1 times 10 minus 95 are the smallest in magnitude normal numbers non zero numbers between these smallest numbers are called subnormal numbers topic representation and encoding in memory Some numbers may have several possible exponential format representations. For instance, if b equals 10 and p equals 7, minus 12.345 can be represented by minus 12,345 times 10 minus 3, minus 123,450 times 10 minus 4, and minus 1,234,500 times 10 minus 5. However, for most operations, such as arithmetic operations, the result value does not depend on the representation of the inputs. For the decimal formats, any representation is valid, and the set of these representations is called a cohort. When a result can have several representations, the standard specifies which member of the cohort is chosen. For the binary formats, the representation is made unique by choosing the smallest representable exponent allowing the value to be represented exactly. Further, the exponent is not represented directly, but a bias is added so that the smallest representable exponent is represented as 1, with 0 used for subnormal numbers. For numbers with an exponent in the normal range the exponent field being not all 1s or all zeros, the leading bit of the significant will always be 1. Consequently, a leading 1 can be implied rather than explicitly present in the memory encoding, and under the standard the explicitly represented part of the significant will lie between 0 and 1. This rule is called leading bit convention, implicit bit convention, or hidden bit convention. This rule allows the binary format to have an extra bit of precision. The leading bit convention cannot be used for the subnormal numbers as they have an exponent outside the normal exponent range and scale by the smallest represented exponent as used for the smallest normal numbers. Due to the possibility of multiple encodings at least in formats called interchange formats, a NAND may carry other information, a sign bit which has no meaning, but may be used by some operations and a payload, which is intended for diagnostic information indicating the source of the NAND but the payload may have other uses, such as NAND boxing. <laughs> Basic and interchange formats The standard defines five basic formats that are named for their numeric base and the number of bits used in their interchange encoding. There are three binary floating point basic formats encoded with 32, 64 or 128 bits and two decimal floating point basic formats encoded with 64 or 128 bits. The binary 32 and binary 64 formats are the single and double formats of IEEE 754-1985. A conforming implementation must fully implement at least one of the basic formats. The standard also defines interchange formats, which generalize these basic formats. For the binary ones, the leading bit convention is required. The following table summarizes the smallest interchange formats including the basic ones. Note that in the table above, the minimum exponents listed are for normal numbers. The special subnormal number representation allows even smaller numbers to be represented with some loss of precision. For example, the smallest positive number that can be represented in binary 64 is 2 minus 1074, because 1074 equals 1022 plus 53 minus 1. Decimal digits is digits times log 10 base. This gives an approximate precision in decimal. Decimal Emax is Emax times log 10 base, this gives the maximum exponent in decimal. As stated previously, the binary 32 and binary 64 formats are identical to the single and double formats respectively of IEEE 754-1985 and are two of the most common formats used today. 
The figure below shows the absolute precision for both the binary 32 and binary 64 formats in the range of 10-12 to 10-12. Such a figure can be used to select an appropriate format given the expected value of a number and the required precision. Topic: <laughs> Extended and extendable precision formats. The standard specifies extended and extendable precision formats, which are recommended for allowing a greater precision than that provided by the basic formats. An extended precision format extends a basic format by using more precision and more exponent range. An extendable precision format allows the user to specify the precision and exponent range. An implementation may use whatever internal representation it chooses for such formats, all that needs to be defined are its parameters b, p, and emacs. These parameters uniquely describe the set of finite numbers combinations of sign, significant, and exponent for the given radix that it can represent. The standard does not require an implementation to support extended or extendable precision formats. The standard recommends that languages provide a method of specifying p and emacs for each supported base b. The standard recommends that languages and implementations support an extended format which has a greater precision than the largest basic format supported for each radix b. For an extended format with a precision between two basic formats, the exponent range must be as great as that of the next wider basic format. So for instance a 64-bit extended precision binary number must have an emax of at least 16383. The x8780 bit extended format meets this requirement. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Interchange formats. Interchange formats are intended for the exchange of floating point data using a fixed length bit string for a given format. For the exchange of binary floating point numbers, interchange formats of length 16 bits, 32 bits, 64 bits, and any multiple of 32 bits 128 are defined. The 16 bit format is intended for the exchange or storage of small numbers, e.g., for graphics. The encoding scheme for these binary interchange formats is the same as that of IEEE 754-1985, a sign bit, followed by W exponent bits that describe the exponent offset by a bias, and P-1 bit that describe the significant. The width of the exponent field for a k-bit format is computed as W equals round 4 log 2 k minus 13. The existing 64 and 128 bit formats follow this rule, but the 16 and 32 bit formats have more exponent bits 5 and 8 than this formula would provide 3 and 7 respectively. As with IEEE 7541985, the biased exponent field is filled with all one bit to indicate either infinity trailing significant field equals 0 or a NAND trailing significant field does not equal 0. For NANDs, quiet NANDs and signaling NANDs are distinguished by using the most significant bit of the trailing significant field exclusively the standard recommends zero for signaling NANDs, one for quiet NANDs, so that a signaling NANDs can be quieted by changing only this bit to one, while the reverse could yield the encoding of an infinity, and the payload is carried in the remaining bits. For the exchange of decimal floating point numbers, interchange formats of any multiple of 32 bits are defined. The encoding scheme for the decimal interchange formats similarly encodes the sign, exponent, and significant, but two different bit-level representations are defined. Interchange is complicated by the fact that some external indicator of the representation in use is required. The two options allow the significant to be encoded as a compressed sequence of decimal digits using densely packed decimal or alternatively as a binary integer. The former is more convenient for direct hardware implementation of the standard, while the latter is more suited to software emulation on a binary computer. In either case the set of numbers combinations of sign, significant, and exponent that may be encoded is identical, and special values plus or minus zero, plus or minus infinity, quiet NANDs, and signaling NANDs have identical binary representations. <laughs> Rounding rules. The standard defines five rounding rules. The first two rules round to a nearest value, the others are called directed roundings Topic. Roundings to nearest 
Round to nearest, ties to even, rounds to the nearest value. If the number falls midway, it is rounded to the nearest value with an even least significant digit. This is the default for binary floating point and the recommended default for decimal. Round to nearest, ties away from zero, rounds to the nearest value. If the number falls midway, it is rounded to the nearest value above for positive numbers or below for negative numbers. This is intended as an option for decimal floating point. Directed roundings Round towards zero Directed rounding towards zero also known as truncation. Round toward plus infinity Directed rounding towards positive infinity also known as rounding up or ceiling. Round toward minus infinity Directed rounding towards negative infinity also known as rounding down or floor. Required operations. Required operations for a supported arithmetic format including the basic formats include arithmetic operations add subtract multiply divide square root fused multiply add remainder conversions between formats to and from strings etc scaling and for decimal quantizing copying and manipulating the sign abs negate etc comparisons and total ordering Classification and testing for NANDs, etc. Testing and setting flags Miscellaneous operations Total ordering predicate The standard provides a predicate total order which defines a total ordering for all floating numbers for each format. The predicate agrees with the normal comparison operations when they say one floating point number is less than another. The normal comparison operations however treat NANDs as unordered and compare minus zero and plus O as equal. The total order predicate will order these cases, and it also distinguishes between different representations of NANDs and between the same decimal floating point number encoded in different ways. <laughs> Exception handling The standard defines five exceptions, each of which returns a default value and has a corresponding status flag that except in certain cases of underflow is raised when the exception occurs. No other exception handling is required, but additional non-default alternatives are recommended see below. The five possible exceptions are Invalid operation, mathematically undefined, e.g., the square root of a negative number. Returns QNAN by default. Division by zero, an operation on finite operands gives an exact infinite result, e.g., 1 over 0 or log 0. Returns plus or minus infinity by default. Overflow, a result is too large to be represented correctly i.e., its exponent with an unbounded exponent range would be larger than Emacs. Returns plus or minus infinity by default for the round to nearest mode. Underflow, a result is very small outside the normal range and is inexact returns a subnormal or zero by default inexact the exact ie unrounded result is not representable exactly returns the correctly rounded result by default these are the same five exceptions as were defined in IEEE 7541985 but the division by zero exception has been extended to operations other than the division for decimal floating point there are additional exceptions along with the above Clamped, a result's exponent is too large for the destination format. By default, trailing zeros will be added to the coefficient to reduce the exponent to the largest usable value. If this is not possible because this would cause the number of digits needed to be more than the destination format then overflow occurs. Rounded, a result's coefficient requires more digits than the destination format provides. The inexact is signaled if any non zero digits are discarded. Additionally, operations like quantize when either operand is infinite, or when the result does not fit the destination format, will also signal invalid operation exception. Recommendations Alternate exception handling The standard recommends optional exception handling in various forms, including presubstitution of user-defined default values, and traps exceptions that change the flow of control in some way and other exception handling models which interrupt the flow, such as try-catch. 
The traps and other exception mechanisms remain optional, as they were in IEEE 754-1985. Recommended operations Clause 9 in the standard recommends 50 operations, that language standards should define. These are all optional not required in order to conform to the standard. Recommended arithmetic operations, which must round correctly e x 2 x Display style two carat x ten x display style ten carat x e x minus one display style e carat x minus one two x minus one display style two carat x minus one ten x minus one display style ten carat x minus one lane x display style lane x log two x display style log underscore two x log ten x display style log underscore ten x lane one plus X display style lane one plus x log two one plus x display style log underscore two one plus x log ten one plus x display style log underscore ten one plus x x two plus Y two display style sqrt x caret two plus y caret two x display style sqrt x one plus x n display style one plus x caret n x one n display style x caret frac one n x N display style x caret n x y display style x caret y sin x display style sin x cos x display style cos x tan x display style tan x arc sine x Display style arc sine x, arc cos x. Display style arc cos x, arc tan x. Display style arc tan x. Atten two y x. Display style operator name atten two y x. Sin pi x equals sin pi x. Display style operator name sin pi x equals sin pi x cos pi x equals cos pi x display style operator name cos pi x equals cos pi x atan pi x equals arctan x pi Display style operator name atan pi x equals frac arctan x pi atan two pi y x equals atan two y x pi display style operator name atan two pi y x equals frac operator name atan two y x pi sin x Display style sin x cosh x display style cosh x tan h x display style tan h x arsin x display style operator name arsin x arcosh x display style operator name arcosh x artan 
x display style operator name artan x the asi and pi acospi and tanpi functions are not part of the standard because the feeling was that they were less necessary the first two are mentioned in a paragraph, but this is regarded as an error. The operations also include setting and accessing dynamic mode rounding direction, and implementation defined vector reduction operations such as sum, scaled product, and dot product, whose accuracy is unspecified by the standard. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Expression evaluation. The standard recommends how language standards should specify the semantics of sequences of operations, and points out the subtleties of literal meanings and optimizations that change the value of a result. By contrast, the previous 1985 version of the standard left aspects of the language interface unspecified, which led to inconsistent behavior between compilers, or different optimization levels in a single compiler. Programming languages should allow a user to specify a minimum precision for intermediate calculations of expressions for each radix. This is referred to as preferred width in the standard, and it should be possible to set this on a per block basis. Intermediate calculations within expressions should be calculated, and any temporaries saved, using the maximum of the width of the operands and the preferred width, if set. Thus, for instance, a compiler targeting x87 floating point hardware should have a means of specifying that intermediate calculations must use the double extended format. The stored value of a variable must always be used when evaluating subsequent expressions, rather than any precursor from before rounding and assigning to the variable. Topic: <laughs> Reproducibility. The IEEE 754-1985 allowed many variations in implementations such as the encoding of some values and the detection of certain exceptions. IEEE 754-2008 has strengthened up many of these, but a few variations still remain especially for binary formats. The reproducibility clause recommends that language standards should provide a means to write reproducible programs i.e., programs that will produce the same result in all implementations of a language, and describes what needs to be done to achieve reproducible results. Character representation The standard requires operations to convert between basic formats and external character sequence formats. Conversions to and from a decimal character format are required for all formats. Conversion to an external character sequence must be such that conversion back using round to even will recover the original number. There is no requirement to preserve the payload of a NAN or signaling NAN, and conversion from the external character sequence may turn a signaling NAN into a quiet NAN. The original binary value will be preserved by converting to decimal and back again using 5 decimal digits for binary 16. 9 decimal digits for binary 32 17 decimal digits for binary 64 36 decimal digits for binary 128 for other binary formats the required number of decimal digits is 1 plus p log 10 2 Display style 1 plus lcelp log underscore 10 2 r seal where p is the number of significant bits in the binary format, e.g. 237 bits for binary 256 Note, as an implementation limit, correct rounding is only guaranteed for the number of decimal digits above plus 3 for the largest supported binary format. For instance, if binary 32 is the largest supported binary format, then a conversion from a decimal external sequence with 12 decimal digits is guaranteed to be correctly rounded when converted to binary 32, but conversion of a sequence of 13 decimal digits is not, however the standard recommends that implementations impose no such limit. When using a decimal floating point format, the decimal representation will be preserved using 7 decimal digits for decimal 32, 16 decimal digits for decimal 64 34 decimal digits for decimal 128 algorithms with code for correctly rounded conversion from binary to decimal and decimal to binary are discussed in and for testing in topic see also coprocessor 
C99 for code examples demonstrating access and use of IEEE 754 features. Floating point for history, design rationale, and example usage of IEEE 754 features. Fixed point arithmetic for an alternative approach at computation with rational numbers, especially beneficial when the mantissa range is known, fixed, or bound at compile time. Half precision, single precision, double precision, quadruple precision, extended precision. IBM System Z9, the first CPU to implement IEEE 754-2008 decimal arithmetic using hardware microcode. IBM Z10, IBM Z196, IBM ZEC12, and IBM Z13, CPUs that implement IEEE 754-2008 decimal arithmetic fully in hardware. ISO IEC 10967 language independent arithmetic LIA Minifloat low precision binary floating point formats following IEEE 754 principles POWER6 POWER7 and POWER8 CPUs that implement IEEE 754-2008 decimal arithmetic fully in hardware Strict TFP, a keyword in the Java programming language that restricts arithmetic to IEEE 754 single and double precision to ensure reproducibility across common hardware platforms. The table maker's dilemma for more about the correct rounding of functions. Notes References Standard IEEE Computer Society August 29, 2008. IEEE Standard for Floating Point Arithmetic. IEEE. doi.10.1109, IEEESTD.2008.4610935. ISBN 978-0-7381-5753-5. IEEE STD 754-2008 ISO – IEC – IEEE 60559-2011 Secondary references Decimal floating point arithmetic, FAQs, bibliography, and links Comparing binary floats IEEE 754 reference material IEEE 854-1987 History and Minutes Supplementary readings for IEEE 754. Includes historical perspectives. Further reading Goldberg, David what Every Computer Scientist Should Know About Floating Point Arithmetic", PDF. ACM Computing Surveys, 23 5–48. doi, 10.1145.103162.103163. Retrieved 20 January 2016, 1, 2. Hecker, Chris Let's Get to the Floating Point", PDF. Game Developer Magazine, 19-24. ISSN 1073-922X. Severance, Charles March 1998. IEEE 754, An Interview with William Kahan. PDF. IEEE Computer. 31 3, 114-115. doi, 10.1109 per megacoulombs.1998.660194. Retrieved the 28th of April 2008. Kalashaw, Mike. June 2003. Decimal floating point: Algorithm for computers. PDF. Proceedings 16th IEEE Symposium on Computer Arithmetic. Los Alamitos, Calif. IEEE Computer Society, 104 to 111. ISBN 0-7695-1894-X. Retrieved the 14th of November 2014. Note, algorithm is not a misspelling of the title, see also algorithm. Mano, David May 2008. The Pitfalls of Verifying Floating Point Computations. 
ACM Transactions on Programming Languages and Systems, 33, Article No. 12, Archive, CS, 0701192 doi.10.1145.1353400 ISSN 0164-0925, a compendium of non-intuitive behaviors of floating point on popular architectures, with implications for program verification and testing. Muller, Jean-Michel, Bruni, Nicolas, de Denechen, Florent, Jeanrod, Claude Pierre, Jolds, Miora, Lefebvre, Vincent, Melquind, Guillaume, Revel, Natalie, Torres, Serge. Handbook of Floating Point Arithmetic. Berkhauser. doi 10.1007 978 3 319 76526 6. ISBN 978-3-319-76525-9. Overton, Michael L. 2001. Written at Current Institute of Mathematical Sciences, New York University, New York, USA. Numerical Computing with IEEE Floating Point Arithmetic 1 ed. Philadelphia, USA, Siam. Doi 101137 ISBN 978-0-89871-482-1-978-0-89871-571-2-0-89871-571-7. Retrieved 21 January 2016. Cleve Moeller on floating point numbers Beebe, Nelson H. F. The, of August 2017. the Mathematical Function Computation Handbook – Programming using the MATHCW Portable Software Library 1 ed. Salt Lake City, Utah, USA, Springer International Publishing AG. doi.10.1007.978-3-319-6526-0. ISBN 978-3-319-64109-6. LCCN 2017947446. Retrieved 6 September 2017. Topic: External links. IEEE pages 7541985 IEEE standard for binary floating point arithmetic 7542008 IEEE standard for floating point arithmetic. Online IEEE 754 binary calculators.